हेलो गाइस अस्सलाम वालेकुम वेलकम बैक टू सुलेमान एजुकेशनल चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट लॉजिक गेट वी विल डिस्कस व्हाट अ लॉजिक गेट इज द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ लॉजिक गेट द ट्रुथ टेबल ट्रुथ टेबल फॉर नॉट गेट एंड गेट और गेट First we will discuss about logic gate. Logic gate is a device that work on binary input and gives binary output. Remember binary means 0 and 1. So a logic gate takes 0 and 1 as input to produce either 0 or 1 as output depending on the types of logic gate. Now let us discuss about the types of logic gate along with their symbol. There are six types of logic gate. The first type is the NOT gate and is represented by this symbol. The second type is the AND gate and is represented by this symbol. The third type is the OR gate and is represented by this symbol. The fourth type is the NAND gate and is represented by this symbol. The fifth type is the NOR gate and is represented by this symbol. The sixth type is the ZOR gate. and is represented by this symbol keep in mind that zor gate is also called exclusive or gate now after discussing the types of logic gate we will discuss what a truth table is the purpose of using truth table is to trace what will be the output if a certain input is given Truth table is designed for logic gates and logic circuits. A logic circuit is a combination of two or more logic gates. Keep in mind that NOT gate is the only logic gate that takes one input, whereas the other five gates takes two input. Now we will discuss how a truth table is constructed. When constructing a truth table, keep in mind to consider all possible combination of ones and zeros which can be provided as input not gate is the only logic gate that has one input therefore 2 power 1 that is equal to two possible binary combination therefore not gate has two possible combination that is either 1 or 0 as input as you can see in the table A is the input whereas x is the output. The first combination is a equal to 0 and the second combination is a equal to 1. All the other logic gates takes two input. Therefore 2 power 2 that is equal to four possible combination. As you can see in the table a and b are input whereas x is the output. The first combination is a is 0 and b is 0. Then the second combination is a is equal to 0, b is equal to 1. The third combination is a equal to 1 and b equal to 0. The fourth combination is a equal to 1 and b equal to 1. Now we will discuss about NOT gate. In NOT gate, there is one input A and one output X. In NOT gate, if the input is one, then the output will be zero. If input is zero, then the output will be one. We write NOT gate as X equal to NOT A, where X is the output and A is the input. We can remember this with the shortcut key as in Word. If the value of input A is zero, then the output value of X will be one. If the value of input A is one, then the output value of X will be zero. In easy words, we can say that the output will be the inverse of input. If input is A zero. then output will be 1 if input is 1 then output will be 0 now we will discuss about and gate in and gate 
there are two inputs A and B and X is the output. The output value of X is 1 if both A and B is 1. If it is not, then the output will be 0. We generally write this as X equals to A and B. The easy way to remember is multiply. If A is equal to 0, B is 0, then X will be 0 because 0 into 0 equal to 0. If A equal to 0 and B is 1, then again X will be 0 because 0 into 1 equal to 0. If A equals to 1 and B is 0, then again X will be 0. That is 1 into 0 is equal to 0. If A equals to 1 and B is 1, then X will also be 1 because 1 into 1 equals to 1. In short, multiplication of A and B is a shortcut key for AND gate. You can, we can see that from the table that the output is 1 when both A and B is 1. If either A or B is 0, then the output will be 0 because 0 multiplied with any number is 0. Now we will discuss about OR gate. In OR gate, there are two inputs A and B and one output X. The output value of X is 1 when either input A or input B is 1. We generally write this as x equal to a or b. The shortcut to remember is add. If a equal to 0 and b is equal to 0, then the output x will be 0 because 0 plus 0 equal to 0. If a equal to 0 and b is equal to 1, then the output value will be 1 because 0 plus 1 equal to 1. If A equals to 1 and B equal to 0, then the output X will be 1 because 1 plus 0 equal to 1. If A equals to 1 and B equal to 1, then the output X will be 1. 1 plus 1 equal to 2 in normal addition, but over here we are considering it to be 1 because we are talking about binary value which is 0 and 1. This is the end of the video. If you haven't subscribed the channel, then do so by clicking the button. Don't forget to press the bell icon to get notification of the latest videos uploaded on our channel. Don't forget to like, comment and share our videos. You can also follow us on our Facebook page. The link is given in the comment section. We will meet again soon with a new video. Thanks for watching. Take care and Allah Hafiz.